Welcome to another edition of the Metal Voice. Yes, Is this, Alan, a, is my this a new edition, Jim? Udo Stilamar. U D O. U D O. U D O. That's what we're doing. We had a great interview. We got to meet the legendary the legend. Udo Dirk Schneider. Yeah, we got to meet U D O. We had the sound check. Yeah. Hung out with the guys in the band. Yep. What a great performer. Yes. He still has the same voice he had 30 years ago. Yeah, yeah. Unbelievable. Was that, he, was that? he can't explain it. I can't explain. That's what he said. That's right. And now Jim's got... The new album. The I got a new shirt. shirt. I got the Steel Hammer shirt by and we're going to, uh And we're going to talk about the new album. The new album. And talk about the concert. We'll talk about the concert. New album, Jim. Coming no, out. Gonna, that's right. Coming out very soon. Very soon. Weeks. May 21st. Something like that. Steel Hammer. Yes. What do you think? I think, again, What's the verdict? Udo, the verdict is this. Uh, consistent. It's UDO. Every album comes out, it's UDO. It's UDO. I, actually, I like this album a lot better than the last ones. Really? Because I found the guitar was less processed. It sounded more like a band. You know, I have one less. word. Yeah, yes. one word to describe this album. What? Which, Basta ya. Relentless. Relentless. That's a good word. Usually, you know, and I, I like that about his album. You know, yes. You give as good as I, I give as good as I get. You got the little, like a little bit of a mellow song tucked away in there somewhere yeah. where he sings in his more natural voice. This song, there's nothing like that on this no. album. No. It's no. bang, 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 bang. Well, there is a couple of slow. Well, parts. a little bit, but still, the guitars, <laughs> like you said, the guitars are up front. Metal machine. Uh, Let's the metal machine. The metal first single. Machine. And actually, that's the one we saw in the sound check. And, sound check. And that was like the first time we heard the song, and he's playing it in the sound check, and we're like, our mouths are dropping. It's it's such a incredibly catchy, it's, it's heartening UDO. song. It's UDO. It's UDO. It's like we were saying about the Halloween. Yes. Their new album. Yeah. It's Halloween. It's what you expect from and, them. And here's a here's a new thing to UDO. Uh, yes. Basta ya. Basta ya in Spanish. During our uh, interview with him, we found out he lives in Ibiza, Spain. That's right. The, so uh, the lovely island of Ibiza. Yeah. And on this album, he has a Spanish tune too. Sings entirely in Spanish. Yes, and he does a great job. Like, basta ya. No. Basta ya. There we go. I thought so that was a surprise. And, and, and you know, so it's probably one of my favorite tracks on the album, and I don't understand a word he's saying. Yeah. I don't even know what you know, Basta, Basta means. Basta kind of means hey, the, the, quiet or something, uh, quiet. I have no maybe idea. It's not, basically, I think it's Let just, our Spanish fans tell us. Yeah, you write in, maybe I'm wrong, but the loose translation might be uh, quiet you, shut up you. Yeah, something Shut like up that. maybe. I don't and uh, Heavy Rain is like a, that's where we get into a little bit of slow stuff. You know, he's doing that uh, slow song, and you hear a little bit of Beatles influence there with really? the little Sergeant Pepper sounds of, of, you know, the orchestra of some sort. Uh, King of Mean, uh, another great track. Uh, Devil's Bite, Timekeeper. Uh, just his uh, 14 tracks on this album, Alan. 14 yes. hard hitting tracks. That's the other thing. I'm counting and, them. Oh my God, it's hey, this songs. Is, this is like unrelentless. Unrelentless. It's un. un it's, it's relentless. Like, never ending. It's never I'm ending. counting the four more Udo. tracks. It's got a little industrial, a uh, little industrial sound happening, a little techno metal a little, sound. Yeah, there. a little bit of introductions that yes. sounding a little bit. Which like sounds that. cool. Yeah. Very cool. I'm very pleased with it. Steel Those Hammer. Keyboards. Run out and go get Steel it's Hammer. It's a must have. Must if have. If you're a friend of, if you're a fan of UDO, this is definitely a must have. Now get to the show. Get to the show. Okay, show guys. The show. Jim, how'd you like the show? Uh, you know, the show was fantastic. <laughs> I have to leave. <laughs> all right, let's get to the sh let's get to the show, Jim. <laughs> Alan stayed. First of all, three bands, small venue. Heard Saxon at this venue. Yes. I was deaf for a year. There was a nicer mix, more uh -huh. more ear friendly. Yes. And there's this band that I didn't know anything about. Who were they? Halcyon Way. Halcyon Way. And as you can see, his shirt. I was quickly transformed into a fan. Yes. Um, if you're a fan of Iced Earth. Some fate's warning. Yes. A very a lot of their theories, the lyrics are about utopian uh, topics. Uh -huh. uh, five piece band, cooking. Yes. They were great. Uh, I had to right after that show. I had to go out. I got the two T-shirts, concert mm -hmm. shirts. I got the album. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna download their first album. So basically, I got three albums out. And this is what I find a little strange, Jim. What? What, Alan? What? The last album, which was Indoctrination, yeah, was released in 2011. Sure. Uh, Building the Towers, which they played quite a few songs off of that album, was uh -huh. released in 2010. And the first album, A Manifesto for Domination, yes. was released in 2008. Yeah. They're out there touring, they open up, they did the whole North American tour with UDO. Yeah. But their last album was, you know, 2011. They're not a, 
It's a little strange, I It's very strange. But great. It doesn't matter. Go out and check them. They're known to be one of the best live bands coming yes. out of Georgia. And uh, I'm going to download their first album right off of uh, the internet. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's, it's a definitely must-have. I picked up uh, Building the Towers. Building the Towers. So you got some death growl vocals in there but oh you also God. have a very melodic uh the songs are a little bit melodic at the same time they yep. compare themselves you like the aggressiveness of nevermore and testament mm -hmm. and disturbed uh but with a, a certain level of a melodicism oh, so yes. uh five feet band the singer is a uh, great mm -hmm. and uh check out their website they had a great time touring with udo yep. and i think the crowd response uh, they really appreciate the the band themselves so so there you go two great albums two great bands you got Udo and uh, Halcyon Way Halcyon Way go check them out go buy their CDs go check them out on tour